Hello loves, so today I'm going to talk about aqua peels. According to my research, aqua peel is a quick cosmetic treatment that does things like removes dead skin cells, cleans out your pores, hydrates the skin, and adds nutrients to it as well. And according to the Renova Clinic, it is a three-step process that involves AHAs, BHAs, and glycerin. So here I'm including photos from the Renova Clinic, and you can pause at each part to learn more about what each step does. Now, Renova Clinic says that you can do this like two to three times a week if you want to, and the effects will last two to four months. But I am personally going to use it as a way to refresh my skin. After all of these summer months of sweat, humidity, heat, and wearing the mask all the time, I feel like my skin just needs a little bit more help. As you can see from these pictures, my skin is kind of a mess right now, and I feel like aqua peel is gonna help reset my skin and bring it back to life. Now, even though I'm talking a lot about the Renova Clinic, that is not the clinic I'm going to be going to. They just have a lot of good information in English about aqua peels. Instead, I'm going to my usual clinic, which is called Abiju. I have been there for other treatments such as Botox and Haifu, also known as Shrink. So if you're interested in those treatments, you can check out the videos on my channel. But just to quickly explain, Abiju is a low cost, no frills kind of clinic where someone like me who doesn't have very much money can still get these types of treatments done. And I always recommend that you bring a Korean speaker along if you're not confident in your Korean skills. So I'll be back tomorrow, which will be like a second for you, to see how the treatment works for me. <laughs> to be honest, I wasn't satisfied with the initial results. For some reason, I thought it would automatically brighten and clean my face with the mix of chemical exfoliants, nutrients, and suction. But the suction wasn't very strong, and the treatment wasn't as thorough as I had hoped. So it felt like a lot of the blackheads on my nose were left behind. The whole process took about 40 minutes, including a cooling pack afterwards, but my skin looked and felt slightly irritated. Then I thought, well, maybe after a few days my skin will look better. And it actually did. A lot of the small pimples that covered my cheeks cleared up, and it seems like my pores look a touch smaller after the deep clean but there are still a lot of blackheads and sebaceous filaments on my nose. This only cost me 35,000 won on my clinic, but I think I'd pay a bit more to try this at a different place to see if they can do maybe a deeper clean. Now, would I do it a few times a week? Probably not. Maybe once a month if I had the money, or I would try different at-home treatments instead. But of course, this is simply my opinion, so let me know what you think, and be sure to like and subscribe to get another taste of Beauty Bop.